What's good with y'all? Money Bound M, a.k.a. Mr. I Get To It, a.k.a. No Rush Reviews. You know how I do it over here, man. If you're new to the channel, like I always say, man, make sure you subscribe. Go ahead and hit that notification bell. That way you know when the videos drop. That way you can go ahead and click on it and you'll be able to check out the new content that I put out. So, um, also, if you already been over here for a minute, you've been checking out my videos and you already subscribed, let me thank you for that. I appreciate your support. Now, you've seen the, you've seen the title of the video. So... You already know what shoe you about to see. And man, I'm, I was definitely excited to get this shoe, man. I didn't think I would have it so soon, but um, I'm glad I was able to add it to the collection. And I just wanted to tell my story on how I ended up acquiring this pair of shoes. So y'all stay tuned, man. I'll be right back. All right, y'all, so we back. And let's look at the box real quick. Bam, you see the box? This is a Kobe box. Let's go ahead and look at the label. Here's the label. Hopefully y'all can read that. If not, you know I'm gonna read it for you anyway. So let's do that. The label says Kobe 6 Pro Tro. The colorway is green, apple, black, volt, crimson. And as you can see, I got it in a size eight and a half, which with the Kobe's, they run a little bit smaller, just in case you haven't tried one on before. Um, I had to go a half size up just to make sure it fit right. The hooping shoes fit a little bit more snug. You know, if you try to, um, I don't know how Kyrie's fit, but I tried a, a Paul George before. I've tried other Kobe's and definitely got to go a half size up. Some people might want to go a whole size up, just depending on how your foot is. But let's get back to the shoe. Um, I know y'all also read the other label. You know, you saw that part of the label right there too. This particular sneaker I actually acquired from Soul Plier. I'm gonna go ahead and put the put the IG right here, Soul Plier. That's the name of the store. The IG is the same. Y'all go ahead and check them out. Shout out to Soul Plier for the hookup on these. Uh, we we made we made a nice little trade, um, and I was able to acquire these. Let me go ahead. And, let's let's look at you. Open the box. White paper. And you seen it? You have seen this before? The Kobe Grinch. Let me take out the other shoe. Now I'll talk about it. that out the box man dead stock lace still attached yes yes it is all right so uh for this particular pair of shoes i actually went in there i saw that they had the eight and a half i, I probably saw it like a week prior um and then i just decided to get rid of some of the stuff that i already had in order to go ahead and acquire these uh they hit me with a nice price on them i think the what was the price on these huh 450 that's what they say on there 450 so I'm not mad at that, man. Uh, I, I know y'all saying, I know because I say this all the time, I'm not paying $300 for no shoe. You know what I'm saying? I, I know I'm cheap when it comes to the sneakers, but you know what I'm saying? When I can make trades for stuff like this, I will do it. So that's exactly what I did for these. Uh, the shoes I traded, let me think. I think I traded a pair of Volt uh, Jordan 1s that came out at the beginning of this year. Uh, the vast gray dunks. I had a pair of those in like a kid size. Um, I had a GS pair of the black and red mids. Um, I had a GS pair of the black and blue mids. I had a what else did I get rid of that uh, for these? Um, I'm really thinking. I can't remember. It was. I think it was one other shoe. Probably like a uh, reverse bread low. I think that was one of the other shoes I got rid of. And uh, once I once I did that, when I got rid of those shoes, I ended up with enough to get this pair of shoes and I had a hundred dollar store credit. So there was actually another pair of shoes that I wanted to get, but I just needed to add a little bit more money. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and shoot a separate video for that. Like I said, I didn't want to take up too much time. I will do a quick review, I guess, so to speak. Um, let's look at the one like this. By outsole of the shoe, got that translucent with that uh, apple green, is that what they call it? Let me look again. Green apple, so green apple. I think that's the green apple color. You know, get your Kobe logo on the bottom of that crimson red. You know, the rest of it is all that, that green apple texture uh, on the upper. Uh, this is the Volt right here on the tongue. Uh, laces, I'm probably gonna go with the red laces, of course, not probably, I will. Uh, Kobe logo on there on the tongue is in that crimson. Get your Kobe signature on the heel with some more of that green apple color. This is like a plastic uh, plastic piece here on the back. 
Uh, the insole of them, what does it say on the insole? I never really looked. I think the insole of it is saying that it molds to your foot. Oh yeah, that's exactly what it says. You're probably not gonna be able to see that, but the inside of it says molds to your foot. So, man, I can't wait until they, till they actually do that. Not that they don't feel comfortable already. Um, I have put them on and walked around the house a little bit. So not that they don't feel comfortable already, but once it molds to my foot, I think they're just gonna feel that much better. And um, man, I actually can't wait to rock these. I got a pair of sweatpants that's gonna go good with these. So man, that's, that's pretty much it. Looks like this video is about seven minutes long so far. So I'm gonna get up out of here. I know you've seen this particular shoe already. Uh, Y'all leave a comment, man. Leave a comment if you want me to do an on foot video. I'll do an on foot video. You know, I'll give you a little two, three minute on foot video. Uh, other shoes so y'all let me know what y'all want what y'all want with that i mean i'm sure you've seen them on foot before but uh other than that i'm about here man i'm money bound him mr i get to it aka no rush reviews you know make sure you hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell that way you're aware when the videos drop you can go ahead and click on it and watch it and i appreciate that y'all stay tuned i got bowling videos coming out uh more videos about shoes who knows what other videos might sneak on to the channel I haven't done no gaming in a minute, so maybe. But uh, like I said, follow me on IG as well, moneybound underscore M. I appreciate that. And I'll catch y'all on the next video. Y'all make sure y'all be safe out there. Don't spend all your stimulus check in one place. I didn't spend none of my stimulus check to get these shoes. Not a dime. I didn't spend a dime out of pocket when I got these. All trades from shoes I accumulated later. I mean, I accumulated over time. So. Don't spend up all y'all stimulus money on shoes. I'm up out of here, man. Y'all be safe. Money bound him. I'll get with y'all next time. Peace out.